It's a big night at the Loud House. Pop Pop's coming to dinner, and he's bringing a very special guest. Hey, family! I'd like y'all to meet my main squeeze, Myrtle. Nice to meet you, Myrtle. Let me introduce everyone. Oh, no need. Uh, let me see if I have this right. Lori, Lenny, Luna, Luann, Lynn, Lincoln, Lucy, Lana, Lola, Lisa, and Lily. <laughs> Wow, in birth order. That's impressive. Well, what's impressive is raising such delightful children. Albert, can you get my coat? Oh, Lynn, your food is just heavenly. Oh, you're sweet to say that. Not as sweet as this corn. <laughs> I can't have any, because I have braces. Well, the world better brace itself for your pretty smile. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lynn Jr., are those your trophies? Pop-Pop said you were named MVP on six different teams. Well, technically seven, but they don't recognize air hockey yet. Has my paternal forebearer familiarized you with my achievements? Oh, you bet. He told me all about your fecal research. Impressive stuff. Would you like to see some slides? You know, maybe after dinner, sweetie. So this is a savvy, and here's his partner, One-Eyed Jack. Card puns? How clever. Sorry to break up the fun, but Myrtle and I should get going. Aww. Oh, I'm sorry I didn't get to sample your mud pies, Lana. It's okay. Made you one for the road. Don't forget to heat before serving. Thank you for everything. Oh, it was so wonderful meeting you all. Bye! Bye. Come back soon! <laughs> I might just take you up on that. Isn't she great? Good thing I stole her away from Seymour. That hound dog had his eye on her. Yeah, his left one. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> She's oh, so cute. Nice. I love awesome. her! Myrtle, wait! My fecal slugs! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hi, fam. I found your hide a key. Uh, isn't it under the thorn bushes? Also, I found your bandages. I just couldn't wait to get back over here and spend some more time with my 11 new grandkids. Speaking of which, surprise! I made these with my glue gun. Life is sweeter with a grand grand? Was your room well ventilated when you worked with this glue? I was thinking that maybe you kids could call me Grand Grand. Why don't you try them on? Oh, you look so cute. Now come on, I have even more surprises. What have you done with my cobwebs? Oh, sweetie, I tore them all down because they had spiders in them. Yes, Elijah, Amaria, and little Jojo. May they rest in peace. Where are my lucky jerseys? They should be in a big, messy pile right here. I took them to the dry cleaners. They got every last stain out. Oh, so everything then made them lucky. Well, who needs luck when you have talent like yours? In conclusion, I have identified the necessary isotope for the... Ooh, you're talking to your little science friends? Hi, I'm Lisa's grand-grand. Yes, we're in the middle of something important right now. Perhaps you could excuse us? Oh, you know what? You just do your thing like I'm not even here, and I'll just be tidying up. I prefer you don't! Ooh, these beakers are full of gunk! No, wait! <laughs> I usually have a barber do this. Well, why pay a stranger when you've got a grand-grand? There. Oh, you look so handsome. That haircut really bowls me over. Oh. Sit shine. Oh, there. No mud, no makeup, just sparkling faces that I could eat right now with some steak sauce. Nom, 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 nom. Um, what happened to our episodes of Nail Polish Wars? Oh, ah! I deleted those. You see, the language is just so negative. Adios, grandbabies! See you real soon! That woman is a nightmare. No way I'm calling her Grand Grand. It gets worse! Look, she left her day planner. <gasps> She's coming to all my games for the rest of this season? My conference in Sweden? How did she get clearance? She's coming on my next date with Bobby? We have to do something. We can't live like this. You especially can't, brah.